17 is just a few weeks old, but the race for the mayor of Cleveland can considered to be officially underway. Councilman Jeff Johnson announcing today he intends to run for the post. News 5's John Kosick joining us now. John, uh, that's all well and good, but we still don't know what Mayor Jackson intends to do. We don't, and as a result, many of those who are entertaining thoughts of running for mayor are keeping those thoughts to themselves until the mayor decides. Either way, though, Johnson said he's staying in. Cleveland City Councilman Jeff Johnson pulls the paperwork at the Board of Elections to mount a run for Cleveland Mayor on what he called a neighborhood's first agenda. Neighborhoods matter. We cannot continue to just focus on downtown. We can't continue to think Cleveland is, is in a renaissance simply because we know how to throw a party for the Republicans. Incumbent Mayor Frank Jackson has not decided whether he will seek a fourth term, which no Cleveland mayor has ever done. For his part, Johnson is in his second act of public life, having served on council for two terms. In his first act, Johnson was a rising star in the state Senate, derailed by a 1998 federal conviction on extortion. He was sentenced to 15 months. The conviction later expunged. I want folks to look at my record. I don't want them to ignore the fact that I made mistakes in the late 90s. I paid for my mistakes and had to rebuild my career. If my opponents use it, I'll just simply say they're right. I take responsibility. But now let's, now let's talk to you about what you're going to do and what you have done or did not do for the citizens of Cleveland. To be clear, there are a lot of people who want to be Cleveland Mayor, just few who would want to challenge Jackson, who defeated incumbent Jane Campbell in 2005 by 10 percent, then went on to best his next two opponents, three to one and two to one. Johnson believes Jackson will run and isn't intimidated by it. I have a lot of respect for Mayor Jackson. I have a lot of respect for, for the others as well. But we're going to fight over the issues. We're going to talk over the issues. We're going to go into the neighborhoods and we're going to say, let's look at the last 11 years. Have you gotten better? How's your life been the last 11 years? And I know the answer to that I question. Oh, and remember, Cleveland's municipal elections are nonpartisan, so the primary won't be until September with the top two vote getters facing each other in November. Candidates have until June 29th to get into the race. Rob.